Hello Hagen families! This is Natalie Springer and I am the principal at Hagen Elementary. I wanted to just give you a little welcome back and a little introduction so that you know what to expect on the first day of school. So students who are riding a bus, they will get dropped off here at the curb and then they will walk back to the back of the school and find their line with their grade number. Also students who are dropped off they get dropped off in the same area. Students will walk back. And let's go check out and see where their lines are. All right, so as students make their way onto the playground, there will already be kids out here playing with lots of different types of activities. We have a few new lines that are painted onto our brand new blacktop. And we have the climber. And there's a sandbox and a gaga pit swings. Lots of space for everybody to play. So when students arrive, they will put their backpack in the line by their class. So we start off with four on this end, down to three. Here's our second grade, our first grade, kindergarten, and the 4k so students will just come line their backpacks up with the other students and then if you are here after 720 students would have already been inside if they're eating breakfast so then you can just go right inside right to the gym eat some breakfast and then when you're finished you can come back out if there's time to join the rest of your class so every morning we have breakfast available for the kids and then the bell rings at 740 and the students will line up to go inside. Now this year is a little bit different, so we're going to try and use a few other entrances for our students. So down the sidewalk on the west or on the north side of the school, we're going to be having kindergarten and fourth graders walk down the sidewalk around the back side of the school with an adult supervising them so that they can just come right in the door and go right to where their lockers are. They don't have to pass by other classrooms to create unnecessary contact with other students. So we're going to go inside and I will give you a little tour of what Hagen Elementary looks like. So when we go inside, masks are required. When we're outside, we don't have to have a mask on at all. So let's go inside and see what the school looks like. So as we enter the school, we have the second graders and the third graders will come down this hallway and they will go right to their lockers. I might add inside, I didn't point this out, inside the door by our playground, let me give you a little sneak peek here. We do have our girls and our boys bathroom. You will notice that our drinking fountain, the bottom part of it is has a bag over it so that we don't use that because that could spread germs, you do have the option to use your bottles, your water bottles and have them filled up with that. And right across from the bathroom, Mrs. Hartman has her room. So she is another one of our teachers here to, to, um, to help wherever we're needed. So we are walking down the hallway with the second third and fourth grade students. We always have students putting out some great artwork that we can add to our display cases. The first door we come to on this side is our library. Mrs. George and Mrs. Germanson are here to assist boys and girls with finding books. So as we continue down, you can see our second graders that Mrs. Anderson has your names already labeled on your lockers. Let me give you a sneak peek of the second grade classroom. 
So you can see Mrs. Anderson has been busy at work. She has your desk all set out. She has your, the labels on them for you to easily find where you'll be sitting. And it looks like she's even got a fun mystery project for you for that first day. All right, let's go peek in and see where Mrs. Cam Mrs. Uh, Musil's room is. So this is third grade. Mrs. Musil also has her desk all set out. Looks like she's got a bag. I wonder what the bag on the desk is going to be. You'll have to wait and find out if you're in third grade. But our teachers have been busy getting prepared, just waiting and anticipating the return of their students because we have missed having you in our school. We cannot wait to see you again. All right, let's go peek in on the fourth grade. Let me turn on a light. So fourth grade is Miss Bischel and she also looks like she's got something sitting on everybody's table. All right. And out the fourth grade door is where uh, fourth graders will exit to go to recess also where they'll come in when it's time to come back in from recess. And you'll notice again that our water fountains have bags over them so that we can't use them. Just another safety precaution that we're trying to put into place. Those of you who are familiar with Hagen will know this is our art room and our music room. In the past, all of our classes for art and music were held in this room, but now this year, because we're trying to keep students in their classrooms as much as possible. This year, music is going to be in the classroom some days. Some days they'll be in the, in the music room. Same with art. Some days they'll be in the classroom. Other days they'll be in the art room. Across from the art room is where Mrs. Ms. Newman and Mrs. Vanetta are. Ms. Newman is our school counselor. And Mrs. Vanetta is our reading teacher. She helps her students with their reading. And then the door right next to theirs is where Mrs. Schmidt is. And Mrs. Schmidt is there to help students with um, and their speech. Oh, let's go into this room. This is our computer lab. And we have procedures ready to go when we use the computers. We'll be able to sanitize them so that we have them as clean as they possibly can be. Now we're down the kindergarten hallway and out the kindergarten doors is where kindergarten will exit when they go to recess. That's also where they're going to come in when they come back from recess or being outside. So this is where Mrs. Thornley is. And Mrs. Thornley looks like she has the pencil boxes. She even has some name tags ready to go for kindergarten. Boys and girls, I hope you are as excited as, as I am. I cannot wait for the first day of school. September 2nd, it just seems like it's so long and so far away, but it'll be here before you know it. So I hope you're just as excited as I am. So we are going by the first grade lockers. Let's go peek in and see what Mrs. Carlson has been up to. So this is the first grade classroom. Mrs. Carlson has some dividers on her tables just to help keep kids safe and keep them separate a little bit. All right, now let's go peek in on where the 4K classroom is. Let's turn on a light here. So in this classroom, this is where Mrs. Carlton will be or Mrs. Katie, as she might go by. 
also Mrs. Aaron or Mrs. Ruggles' car. This is where all of our youngest learners are going to be when they first start to learn numbers and letters. Very exciting time for them. Then if we go across the hall, we have the other door that brings us into the Library Media Center. Lots of computers sitting on the table ready for our kids to start using them. And our second, third, and fourth graders are going to start the year with having a Chromebook for their classroom. And this is the front entrance. So when you enter into the school, let me go outside and show you how, how this works in case you haven't been to Hagen before. So when you pull up, you can either pull up on the curb if you're just going to be here for just a short time or if it's a little bit longer visit, we have the parking lot just down from where we first started our tour. Then you come up to the school and there is this, let's get it in the camera here, this is the doorbell. So you just ring the doorbell, that will ring into the office and into the library so that we know that somebody is there. It has a video on it, plus has audio, so you can interact and talk with our secretary. And then they will ask you what it is that you need, and if it's something that you need to come in for, the door will unlock, and then you're able to enter. So anybody coming into our school will have to have a mask on. If you don't have a mask, we do have masks that we can provide to you. And same with our students. If our students don't have a mask, we do have masks that we can, that we can give to them. Uh, but then you just come right in. Straight ahead is where we were on the playground, is where we came in. And then you can come right into this door, it is where the office is. And that is a little video tour of our Hagen Elementary and I can't wait to see everybody on September 2nd. If you haven't already filled out your registration paperwork, please do that. And then also get a time set up so that you can interact with your child's teacher virtually, which is something different that we haven't done before. And oh, one more thing before we go, I forgot. I forgot the gymnasium. So this is our gym. And this year, we are going to, we have a couple extra tables that we're going to have in here so that we can spread each other out and we don't have to be sitting so close together at our lunch tables. And then we'll have a few different procedures for our lunch, uh, but otherwise everything else should be pretty much the same. But we're, we're really working hard to make sure that we have as safe of a start to our school year as we possibly can. I'm sure there'll be a few things that we'll have to adjust and modify as we go, but um, the main thing is, is we just need to get our students here. We can't wait to see them, and we just need to get this school year under, underway. And if you have any questions ever, please reach out, contact our school, contact your child's teacher, call me, and whenever I have communication, I always have my cell phone as well, so feel free to call on that if if that's the most convenient for you. Um, otherwise, have a great weekend, and we will see you in just a few days. Goodbye.